Hello everyone, my name is Igor. I'm a mobile marketing manager for asktolik.com and today I'm going to talk to you about the latest Google Play feature, Google Play tags, how to use them, what they do and how you can get more downloads for your mobile application or game by simply using this new feature. As a bonus, I'm going to show you as well how we almost tripled our client organic traffic that coming from the explore page by only using the Google Play Tags option. So without further ado, let me begin. So in August, we had an update in Google Play, and now we have the Tags feature under the category. So the, the feature gonna help our potential user to find with more ease our game or app. While he will be browsing by the category, or he will get a suggest by the similar apps tab in Google Play. So all this traffic, important to understand, coming not from the keywords, only from the explore page. So it's a really powerful tool that you don't have any means of control other than this to increase your traffic. So it's really important to use them and it's an amazing feature. We managed to get an amazing results for our clients. And let me show you basically how we set up the Google Play tag for our app. So here, we just will go to the store listing tab. We will scroll down till the category. And here, we have the manage tags option. So in manage tags, we just click and we see here a lot of different tags. What is important is to choose only the tags that will be relevant for your game or app. Don't choose anything that is not relevant. It's gonna, it can even decrease your impression rate uh, or your store listing visitors. So very important, don't play with it too much. Try to test, but it must be always relevant for your app. Uh, so we will choose any tag here, for example, social, click on add, and that's it. Basically, we are done. We don't have to do anything more. We added the tag now. If you want to remove it, pretty simple, you know, we just remove it. And that's it. Okay, so you can play with them a little and uh, track your downloads uh, from the Explore page and see if there is some increase or decrease to better understand exactly what results the tags give you. Uh, Google guidelines says that we need to use only relevant text as I just told you before and from our testing from what we see this is really works the best so the number of maximum tags is five but there is no reason to use all the five if you don't find any relevant text we actually in the example that I'm gonna show you we found the best results for now only with one tag okay so not always be, uh, more is better so now after we covered basically what the google play tag does how to set it up for your own app it's pretty as you see here not much to tell about it's pretty simple to use google play made an amazing job to add in this feature in their interface very simple and uh, easy to understand so now we will get to the interesting part. I want to show you an example of how basically we increased our client uh, traffic for the explore page only using the Google Play Tags feature. So here I want to see uh, to you to take a look at the report from July and let's focus on the explore traffic. Here we can see uh, 761 store listing visitors and 309 installers so this is okay uh, nothing special here and this was in July basically before the Google Play tag feature so and it was exactly around the time that we started to work on this project uh, if you go to August uh, the August report here you can see a huge increase in the explore traffic from uh, close to 300 downloads in July, we get 850 downloads in August. So it's great results. And we managed to make it only by using the Google Play tag option. We played it with it 
we found the best formula for this game and we are getting the best results now. So as you can see as well, the search traffic increased very much, as even more. And this is all the traffic that comes from the keywords. So this is App Store optimization. It's different, we're gonna cover it in the next episode, I think. And this is basically what our expertise, it's how to get you more organic traffic. So if you need any help with your app, you want to get more downloads, via let's say the search channel or the explore channel or you want to make user acquisition via Facebook, Snapchat or whatever we are the place we can help you with that we have a lot of different projects and different niches if you need consulting or graphic for your apps please contact us I will leave all the links below our website, our social media pages, Facebook, YouTube Please write in the comments below, let me know what you want to learn about mobile marketing, ASO, whatever. Let me know what you think about this video. And that's it for today. As a bonus, I'm going to leave you a link when you can get our other case study, how we get manage to get our client 10,000 organic downloads daily from zero. Okay, you're going to learn a lot there with some uh, tactics, some of the tricks that we use, and a lot of valuable information. So, thank you for sticking around. Don't forget to subscribe, and let me know in the comments what do you think. Have a great day.